plans and what we're asking each school district to, to look at as they build their plans on spending this money. We want higher graduation rates. We want graduation rates from each of our underserved populations to be as high as the others. So that all graduate, all of our different subpopulations are graduating at the same rate. We want um, kids in third grade to recognize that they can read and that learning going forward is not just a, a passive act of having something given to me, but now I can control my own learning by my being able to read at the third grade. We expect that kids are going to start to realize that if you're in school, you have a better chance of getting something out of it. If you're not in school, we need to have supports around you to figure out why aren't you there and why, how do we help you make it to school every day because chronic absenteeism is a great way of determining you're not going to finish up and graduate. Um, we, we're hoping that as they look at themselves, they start to figure out what are those biases in our system that have, have made groups of people under, under participate. Uh, for me in particular, I have always been engaged actively in our Native American populations. They, they underperform just about everybody. What are we not getting? What in their culture needs to be a part of what our schools are doing? Hopefully, um, Senate Bill 13, which I helped stood a few years ago about getting curriculum based on our nine tribes education, understanding of who they are and where they came from. Maybe when kids see in the curriculum their own families, their own history, who they are, they'll start engaging that curriculum better to be a better students. So I'm hoping for all of those things. And the truth is, I saw a bit of that in every school that I went to. Pockets of people and teachers and administrators who are making that happen every day for kids. We want to give them more opportunity for more of that to happen. And other caring adults in that building that give what those kids need so that they can overcome the situations that they're in to see how school can help make them uh, the future citizens that we want. Can you talk about the legislative